Good news. The fever's broken. Oh, thank God. So I can get out. I wouldn't recommend it. You're going to live if you don't tear your wound open. If you keep resting, if you take proper care. If I have to spend one more minute in this bed... I'm going to make us both feel better. And leave. Promised you to sneak me some wine, you liar. <laughs> you look worse than I do. It's Tomas, isn't it? Lola told me about your inquiries. I don't have any proof yet, but everything in me says that he's a monster. There are whispers in court that he murdered his first wife. If they couldn't find proof in Portugal, how will you find it here? I don't know yet. But I have to try. I can't let Mary... Oh, but you can. And you must. You've been asking questions about me. Do you think I want to know? No. No, I hoped you would. Why? Because your future wife is a friend of France. Her well-being concerns this country and always will. Is that a threat? If anything happens to Mary, you... What? I would hope we won't need to find out. Wouldn't you, as her fiancé? If anything happens to her, it will be up to me. She's my property now, not yours. No matter how many touches you steal, you'll never be more than the powerless princeling who couldn't even send a few men to defend her country. Francis, is now! Go ahead, say it. I'm not thinking with my head. Head, heart, who cares? He is a monster, no matter what the Pope chooses to call him. If you won't kill him, I will. <laughs>